Good evening, everybody. I'm Fox 17 Chief Meteorologist Kevin Cray. We've got mostly sunny to partly cloudy skies across the area and certainly some hot temperatures. Here's live Doppler radar in a few isolated spots. There's been a couple of isolated showers and some thunder showers that have cropped up. We're not looking for anything strong or severe, but you might catch a brief heavy downpour uh, over the next few hours to the early to mid evening hours. And if you do consider yourself lucky because it's been very dry, southern and southeastern portions of Kent County, a couple of isolated thunder showers there. Southern portions of Barry County have a couple of isolated showers there. And then one lone thunder shower here down here across our southern counties, right on the border of uh, Cass and St. Joseph County, and a couple of small showers starting to pop up in east central portions of New Ago County. So they are not widespread, but the chance at picking something up, especially along and east of US 131 over the next couple of hours will be there. Otherwise, we'll have that same chance or that same threat tomorrow. Most of us will miss out on it, but an isolated shower or thunder shower can't be ruled out even on Monday afternoon. Here's our temperatures right now. That shower and the outflow from that shower has actually knocked our temperature down in Grand Rapids. We were up around 90 and you can see the cooler air that has flowed out from that uh, thunder shower has dropped us into the upper 70s. We're 89 right now in Kalamazoo, 91 in Three Rivers. Most of us hit that 90 degree mark again. And as we head through the evening and the overnight hours, again, that chance of a shower or thunder shower in there through the early to mid evening. Otherwise, we're clear to partly cloudy overnight as lows dip to around 68 degrees. And the next three days of our seven day forecast, the heat wave continues. Temperatures 90 degrees or better. An isolated PM shower will be possible, especially inland locations on Monday. 92 on Tuesday, a little bit better chance of maybe a few more isolated to scattered showers and thunderstorms, but still probably not very good coverage. Then we're dry on Wednesday. We'll finally see a break in the heat. I think as we get into the weekend, we'll pull those temperatures back into the mid 80s and our best chance of some showers and thunderstorms storms comes in here it looks like on Friday. We'll talk more about that part of the forecast coming up tonight on Fox 17 News at 10 and 11.